Hello? It's fresh as we. You can't stay in bed. If it's all the same to you, I think I'd rather stay in my room today. N no, you can't do that. I think I'd rather. If you don't mind. But, but I've got a plan. I was going to show you around the village and the campus and that. Oh, come on. India, we need your opinion. My opinion? Josh's dad's on the warpath about the scooter. We want to know what you think we should do with the scooter. You still got it? Josh's dad's already recruiting vigilantes. Look, we can't get rid of a trophy. We just need to find something to replace it, just to calm down the uh, locals. How about a sculpture? Mm, like what? We don't really want to spend anything on this. You could use rubbish. A replacement scooter made of rubbish. Symbolism, yeah? Exactly. Do you want me to show you around or what? Please yourself. No, I don't mind. I'd like that. Then we can meet for a few pints later. OK. We've... Is that for me? Sorry. Couldn't afford champagne. You're OK? Not really. What happened, Jess, he? You didn't have to lock yourself in your room, you know, cos we all know what Archie's like. Oh, I'll tell you something. Cos I fell for Archie's chat as well. I was in bed with him within an hour. Really? <sighs> Is that meant to make me feel better? Well, it was humiliating. The way he just ignored me. Having a, a one-night stand, I never thought I'd... It's... <laughs> It's not me. Well, it hasn't exactly been the end of the world for me. I wasn't brought up to think like that. Look at me. As one mistake with Archie ruined my whole life. Do you see me moping around? No, you don't. Drink up, you've hardly touched your drink. <laughs> Have you got a boyfriend? Is that what it's about? Nobody special. I suppose it... I don't want to sound, you know, swell-headed or anything, but I suppose I'm not used to being treated like I was and... Go on. <laughs> it sounds egotistical, however I say it, but... Well, I've never been ditched. Not after, you know. I know exactly what you mean. Well, sort of. Maybe they don't to that diva in police headquarters and they've never even heard of a detective, Baxter. What's the big deal? I mean, why the fixation? None of us go near drugs. Yeah, well, I've got a police thing hanging over my head, haven't I? I can't be in any more trouble. Make your mind up. He just said he wasn't a copper. But I don't know what he is, do I? And he could be what Zach was on about, a gangster. Gangster? Isn't that a little bit paranoid even for you? Right, on with the totty hunt. Oh, if he shows, I'll just ignore him. And if he's in the dark, then so what? It's not that simple. I couldn't cope with it. <laughs> You can't let where he goes dictate what you do. <laughs> aye, aye. Hey, girls. Don't listen to a word he says. When he's finished with you, he won't give you the time of day. Hell hath no fury like a woman scorned. <laughs> Isn't jealousy just a horrible emotion? In your dreams, mate. You should be on the sex offenders list. Don't, Hayley, please. Some girls just can't take their drink, eh? <sighs> this is yesterday's conquest. Please. He deserves it. Picked up, bedded, then dumped on a very first day. No! If I was you girls, I'd just stay away from him. You never know what you'll catch. You're making everything worse. Oh, come on, I'm only winding him up. India! Having fun, are we? You didn't have to embarrass her. She's too posh and stuck up to realise that I'm trying to help her. Yes, but you could have been a bit more subtle than just showing her up. It was a bit of banter, that's all. Dave, you were tell her.
when was the first set? You're lovely. Thank you. I'm sorry. Don't say a thing if you don't actually mean it. <laughs>